Now, g'day, guys, and welcome to episode zero of Two Left Thumbs, a new podcast featuring myself and my good friend, Master of the Nerds, Dawn of the Dan. In this podcast, you'll hear a chat with very ill-informed opinions about console gaming in general and hopefully dive into some really cool games and bring them into discussion. Um, let's get into some intros. I am Static Oz, uh, also, aka Static. Um, started gaming in the early 90s with a Sega Master System 2. Uh, yes, I'm that old. Uh, went onto a Mega Drive after that. Uh, one of the, uh, the OG, the original PlayStation. Um, also had one of the uh, smaller PlayStation, the small, they came out later on as a PS1. Uh, the small one with a flip down screen on top. They went to the original Xbox, took a large break um, uh, for quite a few years uh, to play tournament paintball, play with cars, and just generally be a jackass. After that, I came back to an Xbox One pretty much because of Tournament Paintball, funnily enough. Uh, there was a few paintball games released on Xbox at the time, so I came back and played that. Again, had a small break and then uh, been back into a PS4 uh, once when Destiny was released. So that's pretty much where, where, where I am at to the current date. Also, also got an Xbox One just to keep up with all the nerds on the Xbox side. Uh, I've currently owned... What three separate PlayStations and and three separate Xboxes? Uh, favorite style of games are races, shooters, adventures. But the main emphasis these days seems to be back to seems to always bring me back to shooters in some way or another. I'm not sure why that is. Uh, it's not that I prefer that style of game. I just end up there. I do enjoy them. So uh, that's how that works. Uh, you can find me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Uh, PS4, my PSN is also Static Oz on all of those, S T A T I C A U S. And on Xbox One, you'll find me as Static Oz Gamer. Um, over to you, Dan. Tell us all about right. yourself, dude. Yeah. Well, you reckon you're old? I've, I've got, I'm going to trump you. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> yeah. All right. So um, you will find me on Twitch as Dawn of the Dan. Uh, as a tongue-in-cheek homage to the Dawn of the Dead series of movies, um, and the original ones, not the reboots. Uh, you'll find me on PSN as Dankle1. You know, hashtag Sony, please let us change our game attacks. Yes, please. So, yeah, tell me about it, man. Yeah, I, Mine was just so I could play it, use my PS3. That was it. Yep. It's like, what do I need to do to play the PS3 when I've got one? So, Yep, it was like, yep, put, 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 done. And no, no forward thought into what online gaming was at the time. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so when did I start gaming? Okay, this was back on the Atari 2600. It had that yeah, beautiful oh, wood grain panel and all that shit on it. And, um, yep, it was the only way I could beat up my little brother without getting in trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, stomping his head on joust and making him rage quit was, was all, the, all, the, all the rage back then when I was like six. <laughs> all right, so then growing up, uh, we had an Amstrad computer, um, which was uh, like an IBM affiliate back in the day. Now, I taught myself in my spare time the basic programming language and fluffed around making silly little games on PCs. And uh, I used to adore text-based adventures, um, basically where my love of RPGs and everything come from. Uh, anyone remember those old Pick a Path fighting fantasy books? <laughs> it was one of them on a computer screen, basically. All right, so from there, we moved over to the Sega Master System. Um, hey, yeah, Rock and Alex Kid. That's, the, that's yeah. the one. Yeah, Rock and Alex Kid and all that sort of stuff, and basically followed those evolutions through to the, master, uh, the, to the Mega Drive. Um, 94, I broke my arm, being a dickhead, <laughs> and I had six weeks where everyone else was working and I was stuck at home by myself, so I bought an OG PS4, a uh, PS1, sorry. Um, so, and I picked up Resident Evil and D Destruction Derby with that. Um, so, and I've become hooked on all this, what this new 3D gaming jazz was all about. So, um, yeah, then moved on to the Final Fantasy series, which was primarily a SNES or was a Nintendo sort of backed series before that and proceeded to lose a good chunk of life <laughs> uh, between the next four versions of them. <laughs> I think Final Fantasy, it sounds like nothing nowadays compared to you know, the hours you dump into Destiny, but I think Final Fantasy VII, I had clocked about 180 hours up on it, which was massive back then. Yeah. All right, so from there, basically, I've only ever owned a PlayStation. Um, sorry, sorry, Microsoft, but um, <laughs> yeah, I just 
never it was all down to games uh i dabbled in pc gaming a bit while i was studying and that was during the pentium two and three years the heady you know heady areas of that and focus mainly on rts rpg type games uh, but the constant upgrade circle just murdered my budget so i was trying to save up for a house and lots of other things so that brings us around to styles of games if you haven't picked up i'm a I, I like my rpgs uh, so there's always been a focus on that uh, the transition that rpgs have taken into the adventure platform um, i've followed them through so basically you see see a lot of rpg adventure style games dark souls bloodborne that sort of thing and weirdly enough uh destiny <laughs> yeah, which is an fps game so um yeah we can talk about what happened how destiny got me another time all right so where you can find me um, basically i am on the twitch the twitter and the instagram uh, as dawn of the dan all right you got anything else you want to throw in static yeah i'm a, I'm a, I'm a massive nerd after all all that wrote it down making sure i got it all right i didn't mention twitch at all <laughs> did you did you pick that up yeah i didn't nah, i, I just, just i just saw you being humble i just gloss over that just yeah no i'm not on twitch don't worry about that guys and uh, you'll find me on Twitch seven nights a week, guys. Uh, eight to start at eight thirty p.m. Australian Eastern Daylight Saving Time. Currently, when we stop playing with our clocks, it'll be Australian Eastern Standard Time when we yeah. catch up with the rest of or almost the rest of Australia. Um, that's about it, my man. Also, how good was Destruction Derby? Ah, oh, it was. That was bomb. that was one of the best. <laughs> that was that game was way ahead of its time. It was unreal. Yeah, yeah. Tell me about it. Yeah, that's it. It's going back and writing it all down, and you're sort of, wait, well, that's right, because I picked it up, and then, yeah, Resident Evil, like, literally the first game that ever that made me shit my pants. <laughs> <laughs> I hope that's, I hope that's not literal. Oh, virtually. Oh. I dropped the controller. <laughs> um, you know, at the beginning, when you were working, so good, you walked through the first hall, and all the dogs jumped through the window? Yeah. I literally yeah. dropped my controller. Yeah. I was like, fuck. Yeah. I was actually, <laughs> I was actually. Dogs just... I was actually around at a mate's place. There was two of us watching him play it because he was he was a resident evil nut. He's now he's now actually a, man, a regional manager of, at EB. He was a he was a um yeah he was just a, a resident evil nut. And he was playing it. We're watching him. It's just everyone. It was a game you could sit back and watch, you know. And mm. there was two of us watching, and all three of us just absolutely shit ourselves when that happened. Yeah, no, that yeah. was um. Yeah, they, they, for its, they, once again, for its time, it was like, well, first with genre, but yeah. Yeah. Was, yeah first game, as I said, I dropped the controller and the dogs chewed me up and I turned the game <laughs> off and to go back for three days. I was too scared. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, no, no, no. Was, uh, nobody wants that in their life. Yeah, man. All right. A little bit of wrap it up, eh? Yep, yep. So hopefully that whets everybody's appetite for what we have in store for you nerds out in the near future. Basically, on a fortnightly basis, we plan to try and get this out to you guys where we'll cover the news and views on what's happening in our little world of gaming and communities we exist in. So if there's any questions uh, you want us to ask us or for us to cut topics you want us to cover, um, throw it out there on our social media or streams, and um, we'll do our best to try and cover it as, as yeah, professionally as we can, which probably unprofessionally. As, un right. as unprofessional as possible. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> shabby, ill-informed, <laughs> all that, that stuff. That's the way. <laughs> <laughs> Won't pretend we know anything. All right, so till then, next time, farewell. Take care, guys. Stuff. All right, cheers.